Yellow guys, it is Fluffy it says here back at another video for you guys today. Today, guys, we're gonna be talking about a very cool app that you get on your phone and on your headset that allows you to see your phone notifications while you're playing your games in VR. This is called Notify VR. This app is super cool as it not only allows you to see text messages that you get on your phone, it also allows you to see Instagram DMs, all of that jazz that you might want to keep track of while you're using your VR headset. The thing that really stood out to me about this app is the fact that it works with things that aren't just Facebook related, meaning you can use your Android phone, your Apple phone, and get anything you want to pop up while you're playing games on your headset. With that being said though, let's just jump straight into how to do this. For starters, you are going to need SideQuest. If you don't have SideQuest, click on the I up in the top right or go down into the link in the description. There is a video there that will quickly teach you how to get SideQuest and how SideQuest works. Along with SideQuest, you're also going to need developer mode turned on for your headset. Developer mode has gotten a lot more complicated, so if you want to figure out how to turn on developer mode, also check out the link in the description or click the I up in the top right corner right now. Developer mode, now you need an organization, you need a credit card or a debit card, or you can use a gift card number that you put in to verify your identity. Once you've done that, you can then create an organization, which you can then use to create your developer mode account. But once you are able to turn on developer mode through the Oculus app on your phone, you are able to get started with today's video. You're also going to need your phone and your headset on hand, along with a cable that allows you to connect your headset to your computer of choice. For step number one, what you're going to do is plug in your headset into your computer. Click allow access, click allow ADV debugging, and then the green dot should appear over on SideQuest for you to get started. After you connected your headset to SideQuest, just go click on the search bar up in the top right and then search Notify VR. That's Notify with an I and not a Y. Once you search that, click download. You can then wait for it to download by checking up in the top right under installing. Once it's all green, you should be good to go and head on to your phone. Next, what you're going to want to do is open up your phone, go to the App Store, and then search Notify VR and download that app. Now that you have the app both on your headset and your phone, what you're going to need to do is open it up inside of your headset. Once it is open inside of your headset, you're then going to want to open the phone app and then click on the Oculus logo. It will start loading and then it will connect. Once it is connected, you are free to go on with your experience using your headset and you'll get every single notification that comes on from your phone. You'll get game notifications, Instagram DMs, snaps, text messages from your family. All of them will run from your phone to your headset as long as you get a physical notification on your phone. Sorry I couldn't get video footage of this working for you guys, SideQuest was acting up so I couldn't cast and it doesn't allow you to record natively in the headset and I also couldn't use Oculus casting to my PC, so sadly you're just going to have to listen to what I say and compare it to the images. So to start, the actual notification itself is going to look like any other notification you're going to get while in your Oculus Quest. If someone ever messaged you via your Oculus account, you get that little notification that pops up. It's the same thing when you take a screenshot or finish recording a video, that notification bar that appears at the bottom, that is what you'll get when you get a notification off of your phone. The same thing will apply basically, any notification you get will appear in that big box over in the notification app. The one rule is you have to keep the notification app running if you want to get your notifications. With that being said though, if you want your notifications to pop up, you won't be able to record any videos whatsoever. Once again, sorry I couldn't get video footage for you, but I hope this short little video helped out at least a little bit. And with that being said, I will see you all in the next one. Peace out, everybody. Thank you to my members. I'll see you all in the next one. Peace out, everybody. Bye.